This trip started back in 2015. The idea was, what if we grab the best and the most committed of youth all around Australia, rejuvenate their spirits through Amra, and then take them on a journey through Jordan, where they basically get to distribute within their own hands, aid to Syrian refugees, and see the Islamic history that the world has to offer. Since that trip in 2015, the 137 participants that have joined so far have benefited greatly from this trip. And every single one of them, as soon as they return back to Australia, has become a leader in their own sense. We are eternally indebted for having something, a trip like this. This opportunity to, to go through so many experiences, nurturing us in so many different aspects, whether that be spiritual, or whether that be professional, whether that be through brotherhood, all these things were nurtured. See and contextualize our understanding of where Islam started, um, and inshallah we can make further developments to Islam to contribute to their whole community as well. Learning the story of the Prophet. It was very emotional because he was the most influential man that has ever walked on this earth. Until this day, his work is still being seen. This is a once in a lifetime experience. Things that you can't put into words and this is one of those experiences you can only just look and appreciate. The boys just had some hands-on experience of distributing aid to the Syrian refugees over here. They got to have that hands-on experience of seeing what human appeal is all about. Rewarding to see the the effect of your donations, the effect it has on people's lives. Human have been taking this initiative to enhance the leadership skills in our youth. And when they go back to Australia, they add big value. I learned a lot about our deen, a lot about the Sahabis, and a lot about many historical sites where the Sahabis have been buried. Throughout Turkey, there's something that is shaking my heart with so much Islamic history. It's been a blessed and amazing experience. Give me a sense of pride in our history and a sense of uh, duty to do better in my own life. Just like all they did, it's time for us in our lifetime to pick up the Ummah when needed. We will be accountable for the resources that we were given. It's our time to pick up where others left off. I'm very grateful for this whole tour. I knew where I wanted to be, but I wasn't quite there. This trip and inshallah be a spark that will allow you to be a leader to really advance your leadership skills and it's something that inshallah will stick with me for the rest of my life. It would be embarrassing for me to go back and be that person who just does nothing. I want to go back and make change. This opportunity is not something to be taken lightly. This will have a change on you like no other. It is once in a lifetime and it will help you to understand your strengths, your weaknesses and how you can take your part in this community, in this ummah and becoming the next leader that you will be.